so far? No! Well, I don't want to hear any reports of misbehavior. You have a standard to uphold. You're in my house now. First things first. Uh, this is owned by Susan. Hi, Susan. Here's your bag. It has had... It has had a fantastical adventure around the ship. Okay. First things first. Dinner. Now, before you all get snarky, you must understand that lunch lady Doreen has been going through some personal problems lately. And she has never known how to work the computer or the copier very well. That said, we appreciate your patience and flexibility as we sorted through our issues. Uh, the deal. <laughs> Things have been ironed out. Reports of only having two tables up on the second floor of the dining room have been premature. <laughs> Tomorrow night, table tents will be where they're supposed to be. Um, rather, rather than waste paper making brand new table tents, regardless of what the white table tents say, if it is a white table tent, it is open seating. Save a tree, ladies and gentlemen. Turn the white table tent inside out. <laughs> so that's that. Second bit of news from the school's IT department. <laughs> Cruise, okay, here's the deal. And I'm going to use several words that I don't really know the meaning of. <laughs> Cruise Monkey has been updated. You must all... Anyone and everyone who has Cruise Monkey installed on your devices, uninstall it. <laughs> Wait, now. It gets better. It gets better. You have to uninstall it and use the, uh, the web version. Because, because of reasons, using the Cruise Monkey app is basically DDoSing the server or something like that. So basically, the... Until that happened, we were heading straight to Guam. <laughs> the robot that is piloting this ship was just going in circles and kept kicking out strawberry soft serve ice cream for some reason. It sounds great! It sounds great until you're buried in strawberry okay. ice cream. Yeah. I, w I see a couple of hands here. I don't want this to turn into a grand debate, but is there an issue update thing I need to tell people? There is, there is instructions at the help desk. I believe you're not actually using the web, you're just using the online version, I should say. Is that correct? Yes! yes. So you're not connecting to the web, just use the online the web address. And the way here, I've got the, the URL is the same as for as what you would have been using before. It was jcc6.rccl.com add slash cm forward slash backward slash will explode the ship. <laughs> so again, use the URL that you have in, in your Sea Monkey newsletter, add a slash CM to it, and that will get you to the web version of Cruise Monkey. We thank you for this, your support and prayers during this difficult time. And please, we're not kidding when we say uninstall the Cruise Monkey app. We don't want one miscreant out there ruining it for the rest of us. The Una Apper. <laughs> All right, very quickly. Tomorrow's schedule. We are in Coco Key from Woo! seven until four. Yeah. yeah. We uh, uh, the last tender. This is a tendered port, meaning we don't pull up to a pier. We stop out in the water, and smaller boats come and take you back and forth from and to the island. The last tender to take you back to the ship departs at 3.15. There have been erroneous reports that it's 3.30. You'll get back on anyway because the cruise line owns the whole place, so they're just going to do a big sweep. And unless you're hiding on, like, under a pile of sand, it's difficult to get left on. But that said, the last, if you are, well, congratulations. You've become a citizen of Coco Key.
which involves her becoming a Royal Caribbean employee for life. Yeah. Uh, let's see. So, last 10 or 3.15. At 4 p.m., we are giving the uh, discussion slash Q&A about Joko Cruise 2017. We are happy to answer questions that you have. We may not have a whole lot of specific answers yet. In fact, we're likely to have very few. Yes. But we sure are happy to stand on a stage with a microphone and say, eh. We have 50 different ways of shrugging. Yes. We're like Eskimos of shrugging. Mm -hmm. That is the name of my... Our indie band. Our what? Indie band. Our indie band. Okay. Wow, you went easy on that one. <laughs> Which is my Lionel Richie cover band. Yeah. stated is formal in the main dining room. At 9.30 in this room tomorrow night, is that correct, 9.30? Sure, Unless I'm incorrect. Could be 9, could be 10. 9.30, yes, I do have it here. I don't trust my own writing. I'm working on two hours of sleep, go screw yourselves. Because um, you're all just a mass of moving colors at this point to me anyway. All right, pipe down. 9.30, here on this very stage, Jean Grey is going to explore the And right, right after that is the 6th Annual Paul F. Tompkins Memorial Mustache Formal Fez Stravaganza Dance Party featuring DJ Flan. A few quick notes now before we get to the rocking. Dr. Wheaton, your guidance counselor, would like to remind one and all early on in this trip, only you can prevent con funk. Yes. Remember, please, as he says, the 5-2-1 rule. Every day, five hours of sleep, two meals at least, and one shower. That room has no windows and poor ventilation. Just saying. Uh, I mentioned earlier, the Indian lunches that were such a success last year are happening again this year. We will, we will get this information sent around, but uh, if you want to mark down, uh, they're happening Tuesday and Saturday, both of them at 11.30 a.m. in the dining room on deck four on the opposite side of where we'll be having gaming events. You can call 3035, that's the number for Giovanni's. Uh, if you want to book a reservation for any of those, I believe it is a $25 up char uh, service charge to take part in that. They make delicious Indian food. They do not ship. pull the punch. Not get around. Mm -hmm. Also, these uh, Sabor dinners uh, that I discussed in the Mexican restaurant Sabor, uh, Tuesday, between 5.30 and 9.30, they are basically shutting the, the restaurant down and only accepting reservations for Joko Cruisers. You own the damn restaurant. That's Tuesday, 5.30 to 9.30. You can call 4444 if you would like to make a reservation at Sabor. At this point, the time has come for the passing of the torch. We would like to take a moment to honor the, the long, healthy, and benevolent reign of Queen Christina. She, uh, she I believe, has a, a, a young queenling, or kingling. She's a pony monkey. She, she very gracefully abdicated over Facebook a couple of days ago. We did not make a big deal of it because until this point, there has actually been a power vacuum on the cruise. <laughs> so if we would all observe approximately five to ten seconds of silence in honor of Queen Christie. Ten. <laughs> and now, Storm, would you be so kind as to grab from backstage... I will be exactly that kind. I'll be, be exactly that kind. We have had, in the past, the king, the monarch's crown. Oh, first of all, I should say, the monarch of the seas, for those of you unfamiliar, is probably the most important role on the ship. Even more important than, than Joko. 
the monarch of the seas rules over the ship. Uh, basically gets some cool seats down front at concerts, gets a really cool crown, and gets to do whatever the heck they want until someone tells them to stop it. <laughs> but you may feel free to address them as my liege, or your highness. And this year, instead of going to Party City, like I have usually done the day before the cruise, because we have forgotten to say get a crown and or scepter, this year we have had an incredible crown custom created for us by the fine folks at Fiona's Fineries. The same lady fellows and the folks at, at uh, Fiona's Fineries, can you, would you please show off the brand new royal crown? Chosen by true random selection. Will you please bow before your 2016 Monarch of the Seas, King Bill Ron. My lord, are you fully prepared and ready to accept this tremendous challenge and honor? Look me in the eyes, Paul, you know I am. <laughs> Would you please step on up to the podium, your scepter, sir, and as Storm fits, you may have your choice of crown, which, this is important, which crown is he going to choose? I think it's got to be the Kraken. It's going to be the Kraken! <laughs> Perfect. Would you please all hum along with me and occasionally insert words? <laughs> King. Correctly, are, are you, do you have a consort? Or are you just in a room with two other dudes? Are you the first roommate king? Yeah. Okay, you have one other crown. I think you should make them fight to the death later to see who gets it. But not now, not now, ladies and gentlemen, because we have no more time for tomfoolery. Because it is time to rock your faces off. Are your faces prepared to be fully rocked? Yeah. 